Hello, this is R-I-C-K-Y, the YouTube Tech Guy. Hey guys, today I'm here to talk to you about the X-Jimmy Elfin projector. Now this is a mini projector that's a lot smaller than the previous X-Jimmy that I reviewed. That was the Horizon Pro. It was a 4K projector, big, nice, definitely a TV replacement coming in at over $1,000. This one though is only at $649 and it often does go on sale. This is really a standout because it is a mini projector, so it's a lot smaller, easy to take around, a little over two pounds, so definitely travel friendly, and just has a lot of great features that the previous x Jimmy that we checked out did have as well. First of all, this has Android 10, so that means you have the best operating system for any streaming services. It will take all of them from HBO Max to Peacock to everything because it is Android TV, Plus, you can always just mirror your Chromecast to it as well, and it's just really simple and easy. Very easy setup as well, and it does stay supported. Uh, I can tell you on my previous X Jimmy that we got about three updates, and this one has already got two updates since I've had it. So really, I love to see that support. Just it always continuously fixes stuff, and that is something that I haven't seen in every projector that we've checked out before when they've had Android TV on it and they just kind of never updated it. x -Jimmy is supporting it, which I really do appreciate. Now in terms of the resolution brightness, you have a 1080p display here with 800 lumens. So again, this will be good for a darker room, basically going to have not too much light inside of it because I think as soon as you get a light, it really does kind of dim down. Now at 800 lumens, that's much better than a lot of the other ones I see in similar price ranges from 600 to 500 lumens. So this is definitely brighter than a lot of them. And I really do appreciate that. But the biggest feature that I love is again, the auto correction. So the auto correction and obstacle avoidance keystoning in here is second to none. And they just really have perfected it. This is X Jimmy's special sweet spot because it's just so good. The fact that it can auto adjust so that it avoids any obstacles that are in your way or in your viewing area is really great, especially for me because I'm still projecting it onto a wall and don't have an actual screen. That is all the difference in the world to make sure that I see everything I need to when I'm watching my movies, my streaming, my TV, all that kind of stuff. Now, in terms of the IO in the back, it's pretty simple. You have your charger, you have your HDMI, and you do have a USB. Now I will say the one thing I really do like about that HDMI is that it is ARC. And that is really good because you can also connect a sound bar to this projector, which I will say that is probably the biggest difference I see from the Horizon Pro to this model was the sound quality. Yes, these are still Harman Kardon speakers, but obviously a lot smaller with a lot less wattage to amp them up. So let yourself be the judge in terms of the sound quality. I'll be your hero, baby, if you let me. I promise I will be there for you in your time of need. In your darkest hour, on your brightest day. I will be there for you, baby, when you call on me. Or should you go with the i5 12th gen because of its scores, output, and what it can do for you? especially in the upcoming Windows 11 version. So for the video, I did have to amp it up more than I did on the Horizon. Again, it's just a lower, smaller speaker sound, so I had to adjust accordingly. Overall, I will say that if you want to travel, if you're on the go, if you want a projector for maybe presentations, or definitely for a small office or kids room, this is a great projector to go with. The one thing I wish they would have done though is possibly make it portable. Maybe put a two to three hour battery inside of it. I know I would gladly pay $100 more for that kind of functionality or better yet, it's about 100 watts to charge this. Why not just give us a type C charger in the back? That way we can charge with battery packs on the go and things like that nature that would just make it a lot easier to take this around for also being a camping projector as well. Would I recommend this? Again, I think for the right circumstances, this is a really good buy and definitely great, especially for something, there's something magical about projectors to kids that they just love. Like, oh, like let's, let's go around a projector 
and watch a movie. It's something so cinematic, maybe just from going to the movie theaters all our lives. It just is instilled in us. There's something about a projector, and this one is so small you can take anywhere. And I know I will definitely be taking it when I travel just because it's so easy to take around, so easy to put in luggage, and it just really is ultra lightweight. I think if you're, again, a business person as well, this is a surefire bet to take around with you because there is almost no setup. You can connect your laptop to it, whatever you need to, and it really is just awesome for everything you need. All right, guys, hopefully you did like this video. If you did, please give a like, thumbs up down below. This has been R-I-C-K-Y, the YouTube tech guy. Thank you so much again for watching. Make sure to subscribe, like, and comment down below. Also, follow us on social media at YouTube Tech Guy and check out some more great tech videos on your screen right now.